What's up, guys? This is Kimchi. And Tofu. Yeah. yeah. All right, so today is officially the last day that... La, 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 la. It is not the last day. What it are you talking about? Today's the last day the OP. Oh, yeah. Party's over today. And the ED. No. I'm Party so is sad. over. Yes. So yeah, now, like, I'm the song so is like... Sad. La, I love those songs, but... La, 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 this is... This is where we get to find out whether these next op oh, opening and gonna ending is going to top it or if we're going to be like, meh. It is by Kung Fu Hustle. Hustle something? No, that's the movie. Kung Fu Generation. Okay, we're going to part two of Banmon. The father met the son. Yakimaru. And now the other son. No Luke's. Watashi no omae wa. Nani? No! Alright guys, last day for OP. Party's over. Party's over. And then we hit intermission and uh, I guess Doro is going to be taking a break. And then I guess next week, Monday Madness is going to be really lonely with only one mob next week. Alright, we got to rock this song. This is the last time. <laughs> Oh, he's like, what Nanda. are you? Oh, 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 wait, whoa, oh. Whoa, 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 what? what was that? Oh my god, he's right behind him. Nanda. Oh. Nanda. Wow, wow. I think Doro knows. Did he find out? He dodged all of those so fast. There's nothing to him. Man, does he know? Does he know? That must have given him enough. Yeah, right? Oh my gosh. Yep. Oh, yep. Yep. <gasps> oh gosh, Doro, no. Oh. Damn. They're just gonna beat the crap out of Doro. Oh, nope, never mind. Just knocked She's, him. Yeah, knocked, knocked her, her out. out. Oh, with all these other prisoners that came from there. Oh. Yeah, see? Now he has They're, no home. Nothing, no home. Yeah, but. Hyakimaru is gonna go against a Daigo, you know? He's clicking. Yeah, he's clicking. Doro's getting everything. He's figuring uh, yeah, it out. Yeah, I think Doro's. Yeah, he's putting in the puzzles. <laughs> yeah, they're small enough to go. Just go. Run away. This old man. Come on. He doesn't understand the youth of, you know, the youthful. It's fresh. Oh, Tomato's gonna demand. What is this? Oh, oh shoot. Uh, he's, oh, I think he's, he's angry. Wait. Oh my gosh, man. This Now the whole family is like getting messed up right now. Yep, now the turmoil starts the drama. No, Doro, go, 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 Village would have been, you know? If they continued yeah. without. Oh, shoot. Hakimaru's here? Oh, my yeah, God. He's, he's back. Here. He's back. The mother, the mother, the mother sees him. The oh. mother sees him. Oh, my God. Two pure, one impure. No, no, shut up! Tell dude. them to stop! 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 <gasps> oh my god, she called her son, him son. Son. Oh my god, no. he's still trying to kill him! Okay, two ah, against one! Two against yes. one! Come on! Yes! This is brother! Oh wait, hold on. Hold on. Oh my god, so he's the only one that can choose between brother or land? 
like a threat to him. Oh, Doro oh, made it. Him. Yes. Oh my gosh, they're no. all going to be hung. Wow, so they literally got the whole Hulk. army just for Doro? I mean, Everybody, Shati? yeah. Wait, this is the only one that's locked up? What He's is that in the back? All the demons. Oh my god. Oh man, they're gonna try talking him to it like the this, to sacrifice the land is better. Brother, yeah. He knows. Um Tohu Maru. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, uh, the, the shape. The shape and then inside they have that uh, the blood has a different white. Oh. What is the mother gonna do? Oh shoot, he's in the Hall of Hell. Uh -oh. oh my gosh, there he is. That's the guy right there. Yeah, that's the demon. Son. Yup, she calls him son. Yeah. Doro's so happy for him. No, Doro, it's not like that. No. <laughs> but yeah, he did. He's but he smiled. He smiled because he found his mom. No, they just like kicked them out, like get out of here. Oh man, man. Pushed him out. Wow, what's what's he gonna do? No! Oh wait! He's not dead though. Oh my gosh, they're oh, literally the at war. Starting, oh, okay, yeah. so it wasn't just Hakimaru. It was, they're literally at war. Yeah. Oh man, Blue the bottom one's back. The fox. So now he's not going to fight it. I guess he was going to go fight it, but now he's going to leave it to them. She's running away. Oh man, the Bamon's gonna just wreck every everybody. Protect. Oh man. Get out of here. Just out the <gasps> Damn, this guy got all geared up. Look at him. Yeah, uh, he's the guy that uh, ran, ran away. Off and told. Oh no, he's gonna rage. He's wetting in his pants. Oh my god. He's calling his dad out in front of everybody. But that is the sacrifice. That no, way, no, no, no way. No. No. Oh no! no! Oh my God! Please no! Oh my God! He's charging no! right at him. Oh, oh shoot! The brothers. Ah. Oh man, I can't believe this. Dude, I oh, told Maru, man. She's gonna bite it off. Yeah, she's gonna bite it off. Use her teeth. Man. <gasps> oh, he got his eye. Yeah. And he's fighting the demon at the same time. Oh my god. Wow. Ah, so Banmon. Ah, okay, okay, okay. So Banmon, not Spitfire. Oh, shoot. Oh. Oh, the mother came. The mother came. Oh. Oh, she's asking for forgiveness for this. Oh my god. I... No. Oh, the mom's Is seppuku. she gonna kill yeah. herself yeah. too? Yeah, she's gonna, she's gonna seppuku. No, no. <gasps> oh my god. 
No. What's going on? <gasps> wait, wait. Did she just kill one? She killed one. Sukiroko's mom's alive. Oh. They can have that that rice cake thing now. Such a messed up situation. Oh shoot, it cracked right in the middle. All the way in half. Green. And it's fading. God of Mercy is gone. Oh, it's over. Party's over. That's so sad. A mother's love. Hmm? The A mom died. The mom sacrificed oh. herself. In front of Hyakimaru. In the front of her whole family. Yeah. Do you think the dad cares? No. I think they care? No. Okay, right now, the only thing he cares about is Hyakimaru his ruining his land. All right, so uh, we have to watch this again. And uh, we're actually coming back on the review for this. But the part where the mom stabbed herself and the Goddess of Mercy statue broke in half. She's connected with the statue. Right, her and the statue is one, and she's been praying every single day. To right? the statue. Yes, to the statue. And the statue, think it was, so it was actually protecting the land. That's what that, was protecting the land. Yes, well, um, the dad made the, made, sold his soul with the devil, right? Mm -hmm. To uh, And then he had to sacrifice his son to protect the land from goal, uh, from demons. From demons. That's what it is. To protect the land from demons, but what made it prosperous was the goddess of mercy. Oh. Yes, the goddess of mercy. I think I, I think that's what it is. And when she stabbed herself and she's done, basically everybody's screwed right now. Daigo's land, everything is gonna get screwed. The reason why is when she's been praying to the goddess of mercy, and the goddess of mercy was alive. We saw the spirit, we saw it was alive. Yeah. It was actually alive, right? Land is gonna get messed up because. The mom betrayed the statue at the end, right before she died. She betrayed the statue. What she said was, if the, if it's blood that demons, if it's blood that you want, take, take it. Mine. Take mine and boom. She stabbed herself and that's when the demon, she sold, that's when she sold her soul to the freaking demon. And As that's well. why the goddess of mercy died. Uh, and that's the, why it freaking disappeared. Destroyed. Yeah, and then um, uh, that's why the blind man he hold the goddess of statue and it was green and then it dispersed. It left. So that means that whatever that or Banmon or the, the statue, fox. the statue in the hall of hell that's not cracked, but there's one demon that's stuck in the statue, released probably. That's that's the one that's probably gonna get released. Ooh. So the mom. Sold her soul to the devil right before she died. She said, "Take the blood, take my blood to the demons," and that's we, we got all hell is gonna break loose. All hell is gonna break loose. No, now right now it's everything screwed up. When the mom died, everything got way messed up for Daigo as well because now the mom praying that's been working this whole time. That's been saving Hakimaru. That's been saving the land, prospering the land, protecting the land, protecting the land. You know, I'm. 100% sure it had some kind of effect to the land. And now that that's gone, we're going to see a lot more problems coming in. Yes. And guess who's going to get really angry about that? Who Daigo. do you think? go. No, Tohumaru. Oh, yeah. Tohumaru is going to be so... He's lost that. He's going to start losing one thing at a time. The first thing, it always starts out like this. You know how he's he starts off good. He starts yes. off like a good... He has that pure soul. Pure soul. Innocent but, soul. Like I said, when you start losing valuable things, when you start losing loved ones one by one, you will turn into a monster. Like Hyakimaru, how he has the little red dots in him. Well, I'm just talking in per a character in general. Is uh, when you yeah. when you start losing a loved you one, you become evil. You become evil. You and, can become evil. Well, he's just he's gonna become blind because number one, he just lost his mother. Yes. And who who is it because of? Hyakimaru. Hyakimaru. Because everything was fine in their house, except the mom was praying every day. Everything was fine in the house. Now he just lost the mom. Now the mom dies. Now the goddess of mercy is dead. Now things are going to happen in the in the village. 
he has the knowledge that the village prosper everything is through hyakimaru yes and if it's if they see that hyakimaru is getting stronger defeating demons and the land is going He's down it's gonna be a threat a huge threat tohumaru's hatred for hyakimaru is gonna grow and grow and grow so i think what's gonna happen in the second part second part of doro is that we're gonna see an involvement uh, uh rise of a villain here um with tohumaru tohumaru was there from the beginning as pure wants to save brother but for some reason just when you look at villains you know they always have some kind of story like that where you know villains are not born they're turn they turn into a, they evolve into a villain you know yeah they're made they're made the villains are made and i think tomaru is going to enter a really dark path uh first of, you know in the first part of the review we thought that tomaru you know he he might be some saving them or he might be like the fi- final boss or whatever right yeah but i think that tomaru is going to become the main antagonist over daigo Aww. I think it's going to be over Daigo. Because think I, about it. I I can see that happening. You have two sons. One son that grew with nobody with no family, I mean, mm-hmm. and another son that grew that, with a family. With everything. With everything. So, now you have a guy that grew up with nothing and a girl with everything, and if you take that everything away from this kid at that age, that's when he's going to start throwing a fit. You're you're looking at a villain. Mm-hmm. And I think that cut eye open was a perfect thing because, like, you know, how else can we put <laughs> how else can we put Tomaru a little bit more villain like? You He's know what? Gonna make him look like Scar. <laughs> yeah, let's let's give him one scar in the eye. So I think um, when the blind man actually said that this is fate and is destiny for me to watch this happen unfold, I think that's what it means. Is this is the beginning? Of the fall, the beginning rise of an emperor, the, the beginning, you oh. know, he sees the fate changes. He's seeing history changing. He's this is yeah history being made. This is where history is being made, changed everything. This was the spot, the war spot that changed everything. And it's wow. so I feel so bad for the mom, is because for so long she's been praying and praying. And praying. And at the last moment, her last breath, she stole the soul to the devil. And she betrayed the goddess of mercy. She betrayed it. And that's what it does, man. Despair. Like, I mean, that's what it does. It you know? changes you. It turns you. It- it, she don't care. Like, it's so sad that the mother had to suffer till the end, even probably in the afterlife or everything. She's going to have to suffer in the afterlife. She's going to she have to suffer. She sold her soul to so, the devil. She did. She sold her soul to the to demon. Um, and she took her own life. And that's, I, I think, out of all the suffering, the mom, pff, she's had it one of the worst. I agree. To, to, to bear this guilt every single day, to never forget every single day. And when she said that she can't save him, and that's it's the way it is. That's just the way it is. That's the way it is in culture, in, in that culture, and everything. It was that's the way it is. It's just the way it is. Like the village has to grow come and first. come first, and she couldn't do anything. And um, I think the mother knew that Hyakimaru was gonna die there, so therefore she did not want to see her. She didn't. I don't think she wanted to see Hakimaru die, so she killed herself first. So I think that's why seppuku happened right there. Is because I'm done with this torture. The last thing is I do not want to see my kid die again. She doesn't again. want to feel more pain. Yeah. So well, I mean, she doesn't. She wants to die without seeing Hakimaru die in front of her face. So she killed herself instead before all of that happened because she was crying. You saw she dug on the floor, her nails coming off. And she just she couldn't stand it, and she was like so much pain, and I can't see my son get killed. So she was like, "Forget it. If you want blood, take mine." And that's that's when it happened. Tohumaru is gonna misdirect this, misunderstand this, and he's gonna go in a pretty dark path. I don't 
I do not think I'm about 100% sure that Tomato will not be good. He will not turn good. I think Tomato will actually turn more evil. And he, he, his hatred will grow a lot more as we progress. So um, it's going to get scary. At least right now, Tohumaru, we see that he's far weaker than Hyakimaru. Now, with the next 12 episodes, Tohumaru train a lot more to be on par with Hyakimaru. And with the last episode season finale, will be a face-off between the two brothers. It makes more sense to yeah. have the brothers face each other rather than the father. The father. The father's going to die because probably a demon will come for him. The father will... Well... I feel like that's going to be karma for him. And that, so he's going to be dealt with by a demon or some something else. And then Hyakimaru's going to have to go after Tohumaru. Yeah, because once his father dies, I think that's going to be the last straw that um, Tohumaru... It has, or actually, the last straw Tomato has would probably be his crew. Mm, oh yeah, his crew. Yeah, but what I think is, maybe this is just a theory, guys. But maybe now that the land is getting worse and worse, we're at a war right now. So the other country or other village that's having war with us. They're going to see the weakness come in little by little and they're going to attack the village, the yeah. Daigo, and they're going to get wrecked. Tomaru's probably friends are going to die. His dad's going to die in that process. And maybe that's when, bam, that's it. He's had enough. He's lost everything. He's lost everything. So it's it's a very interesting story because to Hyakimaru will face Tohumaru when he regained every body part, when yeah. he regained everything. And he's going against somebody that lost everything. So that's a very, very interesting final battle. Is someone that started off with nothing, gained everything, and someone that started off with everything and got lost everything. Loses everything. That's going to be a very emotional, epic battle that I will definitely be looking for. And it's really sad that uh, Tohumaru, uh, the mother, has to go through this all just because of one father or just this one purpose to save the village. Yes. Um, but is it, do I really think, is it really their fault, though? I mean, I honestly do feel bad for Tohumaru, the mother. It's like they just got involved in their father's mess. Yes. And now they have to be dealt with the guilt. They, they have, have to, to live be, with it. They have to, de well, they have to deal with the guilt, the hatred. Um, you know, I mean, everything. It's all this sacrifice inside a family to save a village you know i just don't know how this is going to end i don't know if this will end in a good note at this point i don't even know if we'll have a happy ending for doro oh don't don't say that yeah please don't say that yes yeah. uh, so man. um yeah that's it guys um that was doro we had to kind of go back and just rewatch and just reanalyze it because there was a lot go that happened in this episode. And it was, I have to say, man, it was probably one of the most intense episodes. I mean, freaking father, mother, son. I mean, the whole family, we got yeah, family reunion. The, they got together, yep. It was a family reunion. So, family reunion filled with drama. Yeah, no champagnes were popped today. So, it was just a mess. Yeah. It was a yeah. mess. But all right, guys. Thank you guys so much. Doro is taking a break next week. So we'll see you on the week after that for Doro 13. Uh, new opening, new ED. Super excited for those. So yeah, Kogi's ready too. Yeah. But thank you guys so much. We'll see you next time. Yes, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.